Uh, this morning, this is one of my favorite students. This is Colin. He's a first year saxophone player. He just played his first concert with me um, on the stage. And Colin looks so handsome today. He is the principal of the day of Maple Place. And as he's making his rounds in the building, he decided to come down and pay me, Mrs. Ruggieri, a visit. And Colin and I are just talking about, we're reminiscing about the concert, and Colin knows that I'm going to be retiring. So this was interesting because this is our first and last concert together, right? Yeah. So what would you like to say to me? Well, that I wish you good luck in your retirement and that you've always been a great teacher for the five months that I've had you. And I wish that I could spend four more years with you in charge of band and stuff, like all those older eighth grade and seventh grade kids. But um, I know you're retiring and it's going to... I know it's going to be hard for everyone because you made such a big impact on our lives. And I wish you good luck. And... Um, Thank you so much for teaching me and have and me having an opportunity to have you teach me. Thank you know, it's been an absolute pleasure, but know that this is not the end of your music career because Mr. Howell and I and the committee have been working very hard to find a very special teacher to take over the program. Mrs. Ruggieri's already been in lockdown in the teacher's room where the copy machine is. I'm already furiously copying brand new music for spring concert. Okay. So I've already picked out some terrific things I know you're going to enjoy. And I think with your hard work and dedication, you are going to have a fabulous second half of the year. And I might be a guest that pops in now and again just to kind of check on the kids, check on the program, see if the teacher needs help. So even though I'll be walking out the door next week, it doesn't mean it's a forever thing. Because yeah. you'll see my face coming right back through the door now and then just to help out. So just promise me that you're going to stick with your alto sax because you're... Yeah, I promise you, and I will try my best. And that's all I could ask for. So I am so honored that you came down to visit me today. Thanks, Colin.